bullet is going to spin. We're going to get drinks, get to know each other, because like, it's just a big meet and greet also for us queer folks. Um, and then Andrea Gibson is going to spin. If you guys have never seen Andrea, you are in for a huge treat. Um, then another break, and then the good Asian drivers are going to are gonna end the night, so it's going to be awesome. Um, yeah. Also, if you guys have never been to a poetry event before, don't sit there quietly. You know, <laughs> there you go. It's all about the audience. It's all about hearing how the audience feels, and it's really a call and response. If you hear something that you like, I want to hear you grunt like you've never grunted in your life. I want to hear you clap your hands, snap, like, oh, yeah. You know, can we practice that? All right, so on the count of three, <laughs> I want to hear you guys like, oh, or, you know, whatever comes out naturally. All right? <laughs> One, two, three. Oh! from San Francisco. He has a queer open mic in San Fran is a popular on the Berkeley slam scene. He outside told me about this amazing project he's working on um, to bring theater to people's homes so that they don't have to worry about the cost and the hassle of venues, which is awesome. And they're doing performances around San Francisco, which he said, don't mention it because nobody's going to fly out. I would fly out. It sounds amazing. Um, at Home Theater is what it's called, and, and part of the proceeds are going to go to Chile and Haiti. So, amazing project. Um, he is a performance poet. He's got a lot of energy and really great. Um, the future Mr. Kabiko. Baruch Porez, her name 